now for a what was what was our expression for the electric field due to an axial point it was 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 2 pi r by r square minus a square is whole square fine now that was the expression of electric field when the dipole is not uh, a shorter dipole means the length of the dipole when considered uh, was finite fine now if in the case of a short dipole so for a short dipole short dipole means what short dipole means the length of the two end of a dipole is very short for example say 0 0.1 meter 0 0.2 meter these will be a, a short dipole so for a short dipole what we have to consider for a short dipole r will be very very greater than 2a means the distance what was r r was we had one dipole fine so one negative charge was placed on that one positive charge was placed and in between this this at a far point r or at, at a far point p the distance was r so when this part means this a part is say for example 0 0.1 and r is 10 meter, 20 meter, 50 meter, 100 meter like this means when R is very very greater than 2A then that kind of dipole will be a short dipole. So for a short dipole R is always very very greater than 2A. Fine. So obviously since R is very very greater than 2A so obviously R square will be very very greater than 2A square means then we can simply neglect A square term with respect to the R square term. Fine. So means R square term will be very larger with respect of this A square term. So simply what we can write? We can neglect this A square term. So then we can write EXL as 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 2 pi r by only R square whole square. Means we have neglected the term R square minus A square whole square. From this R square minus A square whole square we have simply neglected the term A square to the power whole square means only r to the power 4 will be there so 2 pi r by r to the power 4 so 1 r will be cancelled out so the final expression will be 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 2 pi by r cube so that will be the expression for electric dipole uh, for due to axial point whenever we are considering a short dipole but whenever the dipole is not short then you have to you have to choose that expression so this expression only applied you can apply this expression only for a short dipole not for a normal dipole so be aware of that so electric field due to the axial point of a dipole the expression of normal electric field is this so that is the axial electric point field whenever only dipole is written or only dipole is considered we don't know whether this dipole is short dipole or normal dipole then simply we can write this expression but whenever there is a short dipole or in the question paper the mention for a short dipole then obviously we have to consider this case fine so this was the expression for the electric field due to the axial point of a dipole now we will move to the next expression which is the electric field due to the equatorial point of a dipole